This is the first of two heats, the women's 100 metres T12, just the three athletes taking part in this. All three running with guides. Oksana Maturczyk of Ukraine, who will go from lane three. She appeared in the biographical film entitled Pulse. And this year's due for release in 2019. This is something you don't see every day, is it? Garcia Falagan of Spain. She'll go in lane five They're from Madrid, only 16 years of age. In lane seven, the world rank number two athlete. Someone you may have heard about before. Katrin Müller Rodgat. Gold in 2016. Silver in 2014. With silver in both the 100 metres and 200 metres world championships in London last year. So you'd expect her to go as the first one through, of course, the first athlete through in this automatically qualifies, and then we'll find the next two fastest after that. Just remembering that guides cannot cross the line first. It has to be the athlete, or it will be disqualification. Just take their time as they tether themselves to each other. Synchronicity is the word required for this. Your guide and yourselves must work extremely well in tandem. The way they get at the first time basket in the middle there, the Spaniard Garcia Falagan got away well, but it's Maturchik of Ukraine who's on the inside, coming home quickly on the outside. That's Muller Rotgaard, but it's going to be the Ukrainian on the inside, Oksana Maturchik, who goes across in a time of 12.36 seconds. So Maturchik will go through in the automatic qualification place. It's now going to be a race for Katrina uh, Muller Rotgaard to see if she can get through as one of those fastest qualifiers. And then finishing in third place, it was Alba Garcia Falagan, whose goal is to race at the 2024 Paralympic Games. 2020 might be a little bit too soon, but Paterchik, she got away well. Her and both a guide. I talked about synchronicity. Well, they have plenty of it. Rockgart on the outside. Well, Rockgart just didn't get away fast in the start, but Paterchik on the inside. You just watch the guide here as they just release them before the line. Across she goes. Well, Rockgart in second. And Garcia Falagan, who picks up third position. But a very, very start. Quick start there by Oksana Paterchik. Goal back in 2014. She wasn't at the World Championships last year. And that is a very strong run indeed. She'll be one to be reckoned with when it comes through to the final. Natalie Butram, her guide, easing her across the line. So Paterchik takes the automatic qualification place in a time of 12.36. Katrin Muller-Rotgaard in second and Spain's Alba Garcia-Falagan, 13.38 in third.